In the 1984 Olympic Games in Los Angeles, Egyptian judoka Muhammad Ali Rashwan met on the tatami mat Yasuhiro Yamashita from Japan. Yamashita wasn't in good form. During the earliest matches, the muscles of his right leg were torn and he was seriously injured when he entered the final match. Coming out into the ring, Yamashita had to drag his right foot. During the fight, Muhammad's trainer constantly shouted, Come on, attack on the right leg, hit on the right leg. Everyone who watched this match could see that a shot from Muhammad Rashwan to the opponent's right leg is enough to win. But he didn't. The Egyptian athlete lost and got only a silver medal. Journalists who surrounded him after the event had one question. Why didn't you do it? My religion forbids me to hit the wounded, especially on the sore spot. If I hit his injured leg, he might remain crippled. Even for the sake of a gold medal, I could not do this to him, he said. The audience greeted Muhammad with a standing ovation and the International Fair Play Committee awarded him the 1984 Athlete of the Year title. That year, thousands of people around the world impressed by his deed converted to Islam. But Muhammad did not tell anyone to become a Muslim. He just acted like a true Muslim and that was enough. The hadith I recently read in a book says that when asked who a true Muslim is, Prophet Muhammad answered very briefly and clearly, possessing a good disposition. And when asked, and what is meant by a man having a good disposition? The Prophet replied, this is who, by his action, does not harm anyone, a person who benefits others. A Muslim is a good person in all respects. So be such a good Muslim that even when someone who comes with the intention of killing you, he will be eliminated by the light of Islam. Take an example from you and change for the better. May Allah make us all better Muslims. Ameen.